Very quick video, exciting news, update for the Retro Steam Tech Workshop. Finally got myself a decent drill press. This is a Craftsman drill press. Uh, I don't know which one, I haven't been able to identify it yet. Um, the motor <coughs> is a UK motor on the back um, and it's a Compton Parkinson motor. Now Compton Parkinson as a company only existed between 1937 and 1947 so we know Roughly, it's from a 10 year period. Um, but um, yeah, I was really lucky to find this. But I, uh, particularly, I mean, these just don't appear. It's an American made uh, drill press, so that you know they, they do not appear in, in, in the UK at all. It's, <clears throat> it's in pretty good condition considering its age, <clears throat> and it works. It works fine. Um, it's. Uh, let me zoom in a bit on this. Obviously, it's you know it's been it's been well used, but you'd expect something of this age to to be like that. Um, yeah, I mean it's just it was just um, amazing bit of kit compared to a modern um, Chinese uh, type drill press. The, well, there is no comparison at all. This thing is a thousand times better. You know the um, the actual uh, pillar is at least twice the diameter of uh, uh, the pillar on my cheap Chinese drill press. Um, the cast iron uh, bed and table are again 10 times the weight and, and rigidity of the of the cheap Chinese one. Um, it also runs much much slower. My, my um, uh, Chinese drill press will only go down to 620 rpm. This will go down to about 400. Uh, it's got it's got five speeds. Um, it's got a proper depth stop and coil lock. It's just an awesome bit of kit. So um, I can't wait to get this cleaned up and actually installed in the workshop. Obviously, this thing is very heavy, and I can move it if I take the individual parts apart. But it's very difficult to move when it's together like this. So I'm having to film this section just uh, holding the uh, camera by hand but um, yeah it's it is just an amazing amazing bit of kit and I was very very lucky to get this it's missing the lock handle here but this lock uh, works fine so it's, it's uh, I can easily make a handle up for that so yeah as I said, I can't wait to get this one actually bolted down and, and, and up and running and operational. So there you go, a Craftsman drill press in the UK and in my little workshop. Anyway, this is just a quick update video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks very much for watching. Cheers.